Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to play Minecraft with a USB remote. I won't be showing you how to do Xbox or PSP because um, I don't have time for that. Um, it's basically just the same, you just need an install installer to go with Xpatter. So to get Xpatter for free, just type in Google Xpatter 5. It'll give you an older version and it should look like this. It just won't have all these buttons here. So I already set mine up and I use this to play Minecraft with, I said. Um, so yeah, it's really simple. You won't believe how easy it is. All right, so I'm gonna hit new, and I already saved that. All right, so it'll start you out like this. And if you have an image, you can match um, your buttons and stuff up with the image if you have one. Just go on the expatter.com and find the forum. There's a bunch of images you can download and put them on here. Right. I'm not going to be using one because I don't have one and I don't feel like going online right now. So I'm able to first stick, um, push it, just follow the instructions. Alright, so when you use it, it'll find it. Um, so drag it, like right there, and then stick to, enable it, push your other stick left and up. Now I already, it won't, you won't be able to move your mouse yet. I already configured the buttons so the, um, they'll move the mouse. So I'll show you to do that after. You probably won't. You probably won't be able to do that right now. All right. Press your D-pad up, down, left, right. Follow the instructions. Um, put it like right there. Buttons. Um, just press any button on the remote, and I'll find it. So that one. So it'll take a little while. I just can't believe how easy this is. I, when I first, like last year, when I got a remote, um, I didn't believe it would be this easy. But it is. I thought I'd have to open the bin file of Minecraft and go under WinRAR and have to mess around with the settings, but nope. Alright. So I've got my last button here. Alright. My final fantasy um, remote control is all set up. Um, all right, so go to triggers and enable trigger one. Hold left, right, all right. Uh, finish, close. All right, so I already signed all the buttons with everything. This is the last step here. Um, what you want to do to assign a button, just click on any empty button that doesn't have a letter on it. None should have a letter at the beginning. Just click on it and assign it to whatever you want. Um, these, um, the first number one would be left click. Number three is like the middle mouse button. And number two is right click. These are the mouse movements. So that moves your mouse like that. Mouse movement up, mouse movement left, mouse movement right, right mouse movement down. Um, a, um, Minecraft uses WASD. To move W is forward, so you probably want to put that in there. S is back, A and D. Um, you can use these to shuffle between your items, and this button left clicks to place um, to destroy items, right click to place items, and E to go to your inventory, Q to throw an item, and space to jump. And you can change this um, whenever you want, but for now, I'm just gonna open up all my other ones. And here it is. Alright, thanks for watching.